guys, one word to describe this film, diabolical. <laughs> um, no, nah, this film's a lot of fun. I think it's the best comedy of the year. Uh, but I have to ask, did it, this is a, like, a lot of these, uh, the, these uh, things that these kids find themselves in is kind of situational comedy and they're just naive to the situation. Um, how was it capturing that perspective of a 12 year old for the audience to kind of like join in on? Um, well, it, it was, you know, we embedded with sixth graders for a year in, in order to, uh, <laughs> to really get their voices down. Yep. Um, it, you know, it was just, we were 12, and we remember what that's like, and uh, everyone in the audience remembers what that's like. And there's certain universal things about being that age, and you are very uncomfortable in your own skin, you're always, you're trying to be cooler than you are, you're, you're trying to rebel against authority a little bit, you're trying to push back. So. You know, it wasn't that hard to tap into at that age. It was it was eerily uh, easy for us to kind of tap back into that age. That might be saying a lot about where we are maturity wise in our lives, but right. it, the memories kind of flooded back, and also kind of tapping into that energy felt. Like Who, something. It, just out of curiosity, who's Gene most like out of all the kids? Who is he most like? Yeah. He's like Atticus the bully. <laughs> <laughs> and what would you say about about Lee? Uh, Probably, Brixley? Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, well, I was gonna say Hannah, but yeah, Brixley. <laughs> fair enough, fair yeah. enough. Yeah. Um, I gotta ask, how many uh, how many of these situations uh, are kind of like taken from your own childhood? All of them, any. all of them. Really? Yeah, every single one, yep. <laughs> that happened, all that happened to us. Yep. Um, I don't know if any specific situation is taken, it was just more that feeling, that misunderstanding the world, that uh, getting words wrong. Being on your bike for the first time and kind of venturing out without yeah, your parents friends. knowing where you are. Four miles, man. Four miles. It's a long distance. When you're a kid, that's like the other side of the world. Oh, how the fuck are we going to get four miles? Oh, I mean, know. that's the whole... <laughs> I don't know if I'm allowed to swear, but that's how... That's what happens. Now, I got... So, here's the thing. The the One of the funniest scenes to me is the, the uh, freeway scene. But I heard that, that the kids actually threw up during the scene in real life, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, how, what happened? Uh, well, one of them... Uh, one of the kids had to put in, I, there's a sympathetic vomiting. A, I didn't know that was a thing. That's a we real thing. We found out about that after the yeah, fact, yeah. That when some, certain people, when they see other people vomit, they it, it does something to them and makes them. It's the smell for me. Is that if what I it is? If I smell it, I'll, 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 yeah, I'll vomit. If you, really? If you smell vomit, you'll if vomit? If I smell it, for sure, I'll, I'll throw it. Okay, so. That I, and like dog poop for some reason, I don't know. There you so go. If weird. you smell dog poop, you'll yeah, poop. Also, also throw, no, also throw up. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'll poop. Yeah. <laughs> He'll dog poop. Um, yeah, so one of the kids vomited, and the other kid just... It, we Two seconds back. later. Yeah, just and then, and a then lot. We, and then we just turned to, we turned to the DP, the camera guy, and we're like, you got that, you got that, right? Because like, yeah. yeah. that only happens once. Now, I know you guys uh, did some work on The Office, at one of my favorite shows of all time. We talked about this earlier. Uh, and I was talking to Brady. He also wants an Office reboot, but he wants to play Jim's son. <laughs> so, you know, what are the chances you guys can make this happen for me? Zero uh, percent. Awesome. Yeah, was, absolutely. I was, we, put, I, yeah. So well, I was gonna say like five. Uh, yeah, I thought zero, but I was like, yeah, I thought you when I said zero percent, I thought it was a little high. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, we, we could definitely make it happen. We'll, we'll make some calls. Um, also, another thing that you guys did was uh, Bad Teacher. Mm -hmm. uh, is the sequel still in the works by chance? I think at this point, I think it's not. I mean, there's still a script. We wrote a script that I, I always really liked, but. Um, I think everyone's kind of like past it. I mean, Jake Kazan's now sure. doing Jumanji Six, right. and uh, you know, Justin Timberlake's on tour. Yeah. So I think that ship has sailed. Yeah. All right.